Hey folks, it's me again, Jason Revelation. And today, you know, I know I said I would find a job. I'd look for a job. I'm gonna put on my chin strap. I don't know why it's a chin strap, maybe for a helmet or something, but I said chin strap and I'm sticking with it. I'm gonna put on my chin strap and I'm gonna look for work. So, you know, uh, yesterday was day 89. Before that was day 90. So on day 90, uh, Foodie Beauty's cats were, uh, you know, I think Sam was put down and BBJ uh, didn't get killed. But, you know, Shani was so upset and she was crying, so I couldn't look for a job. Then on day 89, uh, you know, it was like the anniversary of Shani's parents dying, so she was having a cry. And, uh, you know, I said, oh, okay, I'll do that with you instead of looking for a job. But I am going to look for a job. But wouldn't you know it, folks? Today, on day 88, somebody sent me an upsetting email. And the email said something about, Oh, hey, I don't think you and Shani are in a good relationship. And maybe you don't really know what love is, Rev. Uh, Shani hurts you and abuses you. Now, look. When I read this entire email, instead of just deleting it, I, I became sad. So sad that I I can't look for a job. Now, I know what you're thinking. There's some kind of pattern to this where I'm just going to make up excuses and tell you what's going on in my life, but not talk about why I can't look for a job when it's just obvious, you know. So remember, today is day 88, and I got an upsetting email and validating my feelings for my girlfriend, wife, and I cannot look for a job. So here we go. Day 90, uh, Foodie Booty's cats died or something, so couldn't look for a job. Uh, day 89, uh, Shani's parents died a year ago and she was crying, can't look for a job. Uh, day 88, uh, someone sent me an upsetting email, so I can't look for a job. 87, 86, 85, 84, 85.